That's what I'll <laughs> take pictures of that. <laughs> if you guys go back to my part of the lot, I'm going to sign. I can't I'm do pictures. I'm sorry. Yeah. Hey, Hi, John. Good Sarah to see you again. From the <laughs> um, can you tell what has this experience been different like from Fault in Our Stars? Uh, I mean, it's been different just because it's a different group of people yeah. and also because it's a, um, it's a less sad movie, um, yeah. which has been a huge, uh, it's been, it's made it kind of the press stuff and even making the movie like a much more unambiguously joyful experience. Yeah. So yeah. this has just been joy. <laughs> um, reading the book, I have not seen the film yet, but reading the book, the search is very much the the main part of the book. Yeah. So how does the film, does the film, is it mostly the search or well, is the it film, spread it out? The film definitely compresses some parts of the search, like all the textual analysis of Walt Whitman. Obviously, that's more of a book thing than a movie <laughs> thing. But, um, and I don't think fans will be that bummed out to see yeah. less of it. But, uh, no, I really think the film is really faithful to the themes of the book. Yeah, so is Margot in it probably more than, than, than the book was? She's probably in it more than the book was, but it's actually pretty close. Like, it's it maybe really? half and half. So, if you had to pick which fault or or this one? Oh, I'm favorite. not going to. I'm not going to pick. I love them both. I really do. Or I wouldn't be doing it. Okay, thank you. Oh, sorry. Can I go first? Sorry. Yeah, go ahead. Hi, Halston. Hi, yeah. Or I'd shake your hand. I'm sweating. No, it's okay. I am disgusting as well. Um, how do you think the character Lacey is in the film is different from the book? Or is it pretty similar? That's a good question, actually. Uh, I think Lacey in the movie is a little... Um, less naive and a little more um, not as uh, what's the word she's she's Thank more present than I think she is in the book just in terms of she's she's a little smarter and less concerned about like her looks um, yeah that's a great point yeah. I mean it's uh, Lacey is kind of a, against the stereotype of a popular girl at least in the book I mean she goes for this guy that you wouldn't normally think that she would I mean did you appreciate the kind of not paying that stereotypical popular girl of course you know I think it's really hard to find roles at this age that aren't the typical stereotype I think, you know, the scene I was most excited about popular girl and, and, and that's what I love about because, John's uh, John's characters in all of his books he uh, makes them so dynamic and so complex and that's what makes them interesting and I think that's why people love them yeah they're not just one thing like people can relate a little piece of themselves to everyone yeah yeah what was the favorite behind the scenes moment uh definitely uh when we walk to breakfast on the weekends on the cast it was so fun and we got movies bonding yeah that was the best all right thank you so much you. Magneto can't stop me, I'm on fire tonight. Even Zod can't stop me, I'm on fire tonight. It's tight, don't even try to bite the side of Mr. Spock can't stop me, I'm on fire tonight. The Wrath of Khan can't stop me, I'm on fire tonight. The board can't stop me, I'm on fire tonight. Because I've got space game and it feels alright.